Good morning. Today is day 69. I think it's July 27th. And I just did one of my morning chores of filling up the girls' pool with some fresh water. Let's see if this scares them when I take this out. Yep, it's going to scare them. <laughs> they are such scaredy birds. Any little movement, fast movement, frightens them. But my morning routine is not too difficult. I come out in the morning, I address them before I see them so that so I don't surprise them when I show up because they're still scaredy ducks. Fast movements frighten them. Right? They do. They do. But they are just absolutely still delightful. A few days ago they started lifting off the ground a bit with their wings. I don't have any really good footage of that yet. I hope to maybe get some today. But my morning routine, I come out, I greet them, open the door, I change the water in their, uh, this is kind of like a little, little holding thing here, and make sure that that's full, and, depend, and I fill up their food in the corner, and depending on how wet it is, like we've had some rain, I need to put down some, some dry bedding today, which they will appreciate. And then I, yeah, I fill up the pool, and hang out with them for a bit before I go back into work. I'm almost done with my book about lessons learned from a jigsaw puzzle. So that's been fun. And the funny thing is during the day, I'll, I leave the door to their, to their big pen open and they typically hang out either in the pool or they forage in the grass. Typically they like the grass on the other side of the fence <laughs> where the fruit trees are, <laughs> which is just ridiculous. Isn't it? It's ridiculous. Or they will be hiding under these trees back here, which is good because they have good survival instincts. And I was a little bit concerned about this gal because she had some weird thing going on over her right eye. But I think maybe it was, maybe it was pitch from the tree that was stuck there. Uh, it seems to be resolving. So yay on that because, you know, what do you do? What do you do? Oh, such pretty wings. Such pretty wings. Look at those chevrons. Oh, you are just the prettiest little birds. You know how to use your wings. You can use your wings to get out of there, you know. I haven't done much training with them yet, as far as jumping through hoops, because <laughs> I've been busy writing my book. But I do love coming out here and hanging with them for just a little bit before I get back to my work. And yeah, what can I say about what used to be not too long ago, 69 days ago, five little khaki Campbell ducklings. Now full feathered flighty ducks. All we need to do now is convince them to start laying eggs. Right, girls? They don't even know. Oh, I just love their wings. Anyway, that's it for this morning. Unless they're going to fly across the grass, but I don't know. They don't seem willing to do that for me right now, do you? No, time to preen. Alrighty. <laughs> we'll catch you later. Bye.